The first thing they teach you in water rescue is that when the victim is out in the water screaming for help, you do not go to them because you will become another victim. Those people in the water drowning, all they want to do is get out of the water and they'll climb over you. That's what they want. What they need is a safer way. What we all need is a safer way to get out there. And so the best option is to throw them a rope. Now when you do that, oftentimes the victim is not very happy. Why do they have a rope? I don't want a rope. I want in the boat. And so it takes some work. Sometimes you throw them a life preserver. Hopefully they are able to grab it, have enough sense to, to grab it. Because even wearing a life jacket, if somebody is crawling all over you, you're going to end up drowning. It's not what the victim wants, but it's what the victim needs. Now, when we look at Elisha and his work as a prophet in 2 Kings, we see a picture of God that is not really the God we want, the loving and good God, but a very baffling God, a very baffling sense of who he is. And it's not what we want, but maybe it will reveal to us the God that we need. We'll reflect on that this Sunday. This sermon teaser, shown on September 11th, 22, is our fourth most viewed video with 239 views. Susan Black again will be speaking and leading in worship.